reported in Shore, why no longer uh, visit father? Well, he did not succeed with uh, breaking my spine through really sadistic issues. Um, he involved uh, sadism uh, in every visit I paid him. Every every visit I paid to this lunatic, uh, he used the opportunity to torture, to engage in torture uh, based on MK Ultra. Every opportunity I paid him regular visits uh, became even more empowered after I began to cover up for his crime, uh, fearing for his life, literally. The last time he crossed the line when I visited him and he attempted to cause me injury, literally through uh, acting idiotically, literally through angering me. Um, this scumbag, this tool, is a tool. This is a tool in the hands of Milan Kuchan. This is a tool in the hands of Borut Pahor. This is a tool in the hands of Slovenian police. It's a tool in the hands of Putin, Vucic, Alexander Vucic from Serbia, Chetniks from Serbia, uh, Russians. Uh, this insane tool in the hands of Buckingham Palace. This lunatic in the hands of... Angela Merkel, German diplomacy, this shit in the hands of French, this shit in the hands of Joe Biden, Donald Trump, in the hands of Washington DC, maniacs, psychopaths, who enforced tortura, physical torture, killing, bestiality on me, beginning H1, uh, decided that he will get he stated to psychiatrist Kapsch that he wants to be seen as the worst person involved in MKUltra. And um, he is very dangerous. He's an extremely dangerous individual. Using all the torture that was involved in MKUltra at General Hospital, or using all the torture that was involved in MKUltra at Home for Elderly People, um, the torture at home for elderly people started in my case when I was a child and it expanded to facility next door which was they would do torture for uh, in a facility which was based uh, for people with a special mental needs so the real reason why I no longer visit my father is because not only um, was this used to trigger the torture, uh, memories on torture and stuff, and uh, get me murdered through ongoing abuse he performed with me during my visits to him, and um, but. Um, This issues here, this stuff here, this this type of stuff here, vas vasulitis, this type of here, uh, this stuff here, this stuff here, aneurysm, you know, uh, the poisoning that went on, you know, the tumors they created, even in my head, it's a tumor, I know it's a tumor because They created tumor in bowel, they created tumor in my head, there absolutely is tumor, because sometimes, and if it's not tumor, it's maybe even worse, I don't know what's worse, because it has something to do with uh, blood vessels with, uh, with this here, um, can rapture, basically, when you, uh, you know, symptoms of the tumor, I don't know how the fuck to explain to you this stuff. Brain tumor symptoms, you know. Brain tumor sim symptoms. 
you know. Um, you see this drowsiness. Vision problem. Um, not necessary that this is this is from uh, you know that this could be a brain tumor. You know, it's not it's not necessary that. Uh, uh, let me see the fatigue. If it's a fatigue also and stuff. Yeah, but this is related to the other issues, the fatigue. So not necessary. This will be even a brain tumor. You know, uh, a brain tumor. One of the most characteristic signs of brain tumor that is not explained, pointed out over there. I don't know how is when you you feel like you know, you know, the picture is, you know, sometimes. Whew, how come the fuck you don't mention this stuff over there? You're making me waste my fucking time on this. This is just the latest stuff. This is the latest fashion that surfaced up, but this is the stuff that also went on during MK Ultra. So, stuff I was trying to explain. <coughs> the reason why I don't go visit father is, have uh, they told me. <laughs> King Charles with the police, they were asking me if I feel any kind of discomfort, pain. Um, I don't know how you say this. Navel, abdomen area, you know, in a, in a, in a, in a navel area. Right? If I take this in account, this picture here, so it's, it's so small. Yeah. Okay. Uh, do you feel any kind of, do, but no, 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 no. Don't you feel? And don't you feel what? They started to talk to me about the bowel cancer. And so how that went. But don't you, but don't you feel anything? Don't you feel on your right side of, uh, what's the name of this here? Neville? Don't you feel it? Try. Test yourself. Yeah, it was a pain. It was a sharp pain. But this is stuff. This is how it was during MK Ultra. This is the way it was. Aneurysm is nothing to fuck around. This is nothing to... You know what the lymphoma cancer is? Lymphoma cancer? Read. This is nothing funny to fuck around. Even less when you have a cancer here. When they develop the tumor here, they develop several locations of tumor. They develop tumors here in in my in my left arm underarm they caused injury on the left side of my heart they caused injury that made me feel I'm never gonna walk again in the left center of the foot It makes me uncomfortable to talk about the number of the injuries they created. They created the injury on in that felt like I'm gonna fucking die on the right side of my back, literally poisoning and making certain moves to intensify to intensify that stuff. Through the poisoning sessions, this stuff would surface boy like nothing. So I guess that's got to do with the blood and all kinds of issues and so on. With it, you know. Stuff I'm talking about. Everything that was done during MK Ultra was done through the poisoning. It was always pain that was present. It was always the stuff that, that went on. Including torture at the father inside of the general hospital and inside of the home for elderly people. So 
when you get three hours, when you get four hours of sleep, and you eat shit, and you are under a lot of stress, and you are subjected to attacks, 24-7 attacks, outside and inside of the house. Wherever the fuck you go, it's attack. Wherever the fuck you go, it's people that were involved in MK Ultra. When you are find yourself under this kind of circumstances, uh, by literally, you know, visiting some kind of pedo that was involved in killing you procedure since your childhood, and you're still trying to go beyond yourself. You still try to go and catter the motherfucker. You still try to make him feel good. You still bring the movies there. You still try to to spend a good time. And the, the only thing you do this is so he smashes you every fucking time you go. So you go home all depressed, frustrated, half crazy. Uh, think about the torture that he's reminding you of that went on during MK Ultra torture. This is a fucking beast. This is a fucking beast. Would you want to go to visit your papa like this? Uh, a ticket of Joe Biden, a lucky ticket from Joe Biden, a lucky ticket from your King Charles. Would you want to go to visit a motherfucker like this that is working in there, that is eating good, that is being taken care of, that gets more than enough sleep, and you're getting three, four hours of sleep a day. You, if it's a six hours of sleep, it's a fucking holiday in my case. And 24-7 you hear shh. Like it feels like it's going to burst the fucking vessels. And you don't fucking know whether is it from the heart or is it that you have a tumor problem or is it that you have in some other maybe lymph node or something which they are malfunctioning. You eat shit. You dumped down, compelled, raped into eating shit. After being poisoned, this is what the fuck you want to do? You want to go and you want to do this kind of stuff? I think this is the most sadistic. As your health is deteriorating, because this is the way it is. The way they have designed this stuff is no way you could cure yourself but you definitely would deteriorate yourself without medical attention. Die. Absolutely. Everybody involved in MK Ultra knew about this stuff. So you want to go under this kind of circumstances to witness the motherfucker uh, subjecting you to more and more and more and more psychological abuse and even physical abuse because you try to lift him, make his day up, take him out, uh, try to do best to also have some form of satisfaction out of it. And all you get is... You want to go and do the stuff like this? Well, you, you yourself need serious medical assistance for your life to be saved. And you take time to go visit a motherfucker, pay him attention, and he does the stuff like this. You want to go and you want to do this? You can call me a bad man, you can call me a good man, but uh, Hollywood people wanted me to be, to, to be, to look good, skinny, and I don't know what the fuck. Uh, and they wanted me to take care of my papa, all the people involved in it. You must take care of your papa, you must take care, you must, you can only do this, you must prove. Oh yeah, because I owe something, right? I owe you motherfuckers. What, the, what exactly do I owe any one of you? Like what? I owe you. Nobody asked you for any help. You were never helped. None of you ever was a help. You were cancer. In this case, worse than cancer. You were not any kind of solution. You were out there. You digged out there to get me killed. To make me kill myself. In this case, it's all about the survival. And when it comes to the stuff like this, quite naturally that my father is not going to see me until he's going to have, until he's going to get the handcuffs on his hands and be taken out of there to the place where he should have been in the first place. He's a fucking dunk, a shit, like he wanted to be, like he required from psychiatrist Peter Kopsch. He wanted to be the worst person 
in the world in my eyes basically this is the way this is why I don't go fa uh, visit my father anymore at home for elderly people because I live to see the motherfucker dragged into the prison so that he can meet reality one time in his lifetime fucking shit back Milan coach on his private tool dirt back Borut Pahor tool Robert Golobis tool this is why I don't go visit my father anymore and I know that none of you would have gone to distance of even 1% even in case of father stay in the hospital as I did none of you would made it shit because none of you made shit in your lifetime anyways you couldn't even fucking I'm not gonna say solve this issue but look at you motherfuckers in the mirror look at you motherfuckers all you have on yourself is stolen stolen clothing stolen food in the fridge stolen cars in the garages it's all based on thuggery on a theft on your constitution 